It's Minnesota and Nebraska. will be starting at the five, but it's Mason from the wing for three. In the lineup again tonight. Here's Murphy, mid-range game. Good start, chaos, forces a turnover. It's McBrayer, the pull-up. Murphy with the tip. Came an 11-point deficit the last 10 minutes of that game to win in Madison for the first time since 1990. Copeland from the wing. It would look very similar to what Minnesota does right now. It's a great point. Roby against Murphy. It's Roby from the corner. Against Wisconsin. It's Murphy from the baseline. Palmer, eight rebounds in the Wisconsin game. Let's go along with 28 points. Watson, big game against Wisconsin in December. For Nebraska, especially early in games and offense. Watson for the lead, yes! He'll shoot over Copeland, deep three. From the field. Watson, the lob to Roby, went up high. And then laid it in. Nebraska, and it's Palmer. Up the floor, Copeland running, catching, and laying it up and in. Minnesota's 12 coming from two players, Mason and Murphy, six points apiece. And speaking of Murphy, against Copeland, stronger, bigger, and scores. Because if he doesn't, they'll run that play until he does. And the first meeting, foul trouble impacted the Minnesota front court and even Nate Mason as well. Shavunga has been really good since coming back off of that two game loss, two games where he didn't play. All the Big Ten. Washington, the floater, pretty, and that's what he's been doing. Will, he's got such a great handle, he's a lot stronger than he appears. Everything falling right now for Nebraska. From the Big Ten up until about five games ago. For tonight, Gill last four games, only two of 16 from three. Nice pass down low, Kanate. Watson to crease over Kanate, tough shot, but they left Chamaga wide open for the weak side tip. Roby. Harris will drive, and really no angle there. The lead for Murphy and a turnover. Here's Palmer. Can he answer in transition? Yes, end to end. Scored in over three minutes. Murphy the double team. Swing it to Harris. Good three-point shooter. One point loss to Kansas. Palmer for three. He's feeling it now. Four or five shots. That doesn't change his game. He's still going to constantly attack. Yes, he is. And that, that's, he only knows one way. It's Gill running the floor in transition. Now the Huskers. It's Palmer to Gill for three. And they've got multiple guys that can do it. It's Murphy. And Copeland got in there. Murphy's still fighting and scoring. Of course. But being at West Lafayette with Robbie Hummel, let me tell you something. Oh, you don't pay for a meal. You don't. On the block. Now Roby the left hand. Here the Gophers try to get this under 10. Mason, there's a way to do it. Mason with 13 of the 30 Minnesota points. Allen, can he answer? Yes, and that's how it's gone tonight for the visitors from Lincoln. Washington splits defender, somehow got that shot off. You know, Minnesota's had some success on their own. Washington will be the man with one, got it off. Isaiah Washington, the Big Ten freshman of the week, with a three at the buzzer, and the Gophers. Down seven at halftime and the half on a 7 nothing run. This great individual effort by the freshman, Jelly Fan. Washington starts the second half. The lead for Murphy. Murphy squaring up Roby, spinning. Short, look at Washington try to battle. Somehow found Murphy. And it's Palmer. Watson for three. And, and you know what, they're, they're really 10 to 12 freshmen around the country that come in. Lost it. Murphy. Two. Or the junior from San Antonio. Watson, the no look lob to Roby. A, a deadly combination for opponents. Washington, there's a good lead to Fitzgerald. I love seeing this when a guard and a forward can hook up on a pick and roll like this. Just go get it, big fella. Isaiah Roby, the recipient of a beautiful lead pass. Output I've seen in quite a while. Palmer and one. Ohio State. 
Ohio State going to be very confident going into that game. Nice look inside. Murphy, he displayed that in the first half. But does so here in the second half. It was McGrayer on Palmer earlier. Now it's Mason. It's changed. Jamanga down low. Tough angle. Got his own rebound underneath against Murphy, and it falls. In this current four-minute segment, Allen got Harris up, reloads, and knocks down the three. Allen got Harris up, reloads, and knocks down the three. The 10th made three tonight for Nebraska. To hit the game. Allen, how pretty was that on one end, and Mason counters on the other. Miles thought there should have been a foul on that contact. Mason Kanate. Mason for three. Murphy against Roby. To a cutting hurt and one. Copeland against Murphy from the elbow. A great response there from Copeland. Roby mismatch over Mason. Nebraska, they don't waste time. It's Taylor end to end. Team and two. They had the crowd going. Murphy though inside. He has 20. Decision to come someplace. You go to Pinnacle Bank <laughs> Arena. You sold. That's right. Michael hurt. Taylor from the elbow, smooth. Double team here, Murphy, and he got away with a hook on Roby and sends it down. Watson throws it up again. We've seen that throughout the night, the two-man game, Watson and Roby. Murphy left it for Washington against Roby and one. And it's at seven, Copeland sees it, now loses it. Taylor with three, got it off and oh, scores. Wow. Nebraska breaks the pressure, and it's Roby one more time. In impressive fashion. Harris, big spot, big result. His second three. The Gophers get a stop here. Palmer against Hurt, too strong. Roby the tip, yes! As a visiting coach here at the bar. Mason for three. Gophers down seven, still with life. Mason, can he do it again? Yes! Gophers in this game. 18 seconds. Mason off the glass. A career high 34 points now for Nate Mason. Now Nebraska's been so good at the free throw line. And that will be the game as Nebraska wins for the ninth time in the Big Ten. Now 18 and 8. Tim Miles, his first ever win. You're at the barn.